Greetings and welcome to Let's Play My Channel Logo. Well, it's weekly vlog time. Something people are looking forward to. Well, maybe, I don't know. The last one got like two comments. <laughs> so here we go. Um, first of all, I did start recording a Let's Play. Even though I said the last week that I'm officially on a break at the moment. But I did feel like, well, playing a game and record it. So, yay! I also, something that um, helped is I'm going to do 20 minutes. 25. Maximum 30 minutes now per video. So, when I start up, look, I recorded 7 videos and it only took me like, well, Two and a half hours instead of you know seven hours and yeah it gives, me, it gives me more time to make content and I will start uploading once it is finished and I think the game is five and a half hours long according to how long to beat so yeah, I guess I have two weeks full of content, which gives me plenty of time to start another video. I won't upload it yet. I will upload when I finished it. So it may not be this week, but maybe next week. No. So that's the big announcement. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a second big announcement. Why? Right. Yeah. So I had my blood tests taken again this week. On Wednesday, yeah, this time she only needed like two, two twice until she <laughs> found a vein. And I got the results back on Friday and everything improved. It's not in the green, of course, can't after a month, but thanks to a strict ketogenic diet, my blood uh, tests were all better. Liver, um, blood sugar, so no more diabetes. Oh, well, soon, oh, well, not not scratching on it, let's say it this way. So, no diabetes, uh, liver better, uh, my, I don't know what else, something that causes your joints to hurt. I think it's something with Harnsäure, it's the German word. Some, some Something acidic that also got better. So, yeah, one month of strict ketogenic diet, if you can call it a diet, I will talk more about this in a second, no alcohol, no energy drinks anymore, and I also reduced uh, caffeine, I'm only drinking matcha tea, I had like two coffee in the month, because I felt like I needed it, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling great, that's the good thing, so again, I can only suggest this to people, and also I needed to, um, get my uh, belt tighter twice so two holes tighter that means and according to my scales I lost about 10 kilo 22 pounds and yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. so I, I again I can only suggest this diet to people who are overweight you may ask what are you eating all the day I'm like I'm eating until I'm full and I usually eat like twice per day if at all if I have to like I usually eat more when I'm at work because even though I can be hungry and not moody anymore it still helps when I don't have to I can concentrate better on a full stomach let's say this way um what am I eating? Pff, depends. In the morning I usually have like three packs of salami snacks. Sometimes combined with some uh, garlic cream cheese. So that's good. <laughs> I can't, can't complain about this. When I'm at work I, I can't make any big uh, meals or something like that. I usually have like a in German you have something called Wurstsalat, a sausage salad. You take like bolognese, bologna or whatever you call it and you slice it into well, slices. You add vinegar, oil, salt, pepper and I do a little bit of mustard. Then you mix it and voila! And I eat some cheese with that. 
So, and if I'm feeling fancy, I take like a lettuce and take the leaves, the big leaves, and fill them with either the salad I just mentioned or avocado, um, uh, some meat I buy from the butcher already prepared and stuff, like already cooked and so on. And I put this in this lettuce leaf and then I can wrap it like a wrap and eat that. It's awesome, it's awesome. And in the afternoon, if I really feel like uh, when I come home, uh, if I'm even eating something, which is not every day, I am usually eggs with cheese. Something I love to do. It, it's so I wish I knew about this four years ago. You take some grated cheese, like a handful, and you put it in a hot pan, and you make it like... You make like a small circle of it and then you wait until it's a little bit hard on one side then you flip it and well wait until well it's hard on this side too and then you put it on a plate you I do like four or five of them of a 200 gram pack and you can use them like a, a bread so they are pretty hard so and firm so you can put stuff on it and you can just keep it in your hand and eat this it, it's if you can't eat bread, <laughs> it's the best thing to the easiest thing also to bread than anything else. I I don't feel like I'm not one of these people who loves baking and getting like this almond flour bread or something like that because even though it is ketogenic, you still have to look after the carbs. And I, if if I like something, I just eat. Yeah, well, I want to eat. <laughs> I don't want to be like, oh, I can only have three slices of this bread and I have too many carbs. Mm -hmm. No, I, I don't want that. So I usually eat this, yeah, well, with cream cheese on top of it or lettuce again or making like uh, burgers or so. And I am losing weight. Bacon with eggs is usually what I eat in the morning on weekends. And then today I um, I had some chicken kassler. I have no idea what kassler means in English. Kassler dipped. Kassler is uh, smoked pork chop. Okay. Well, I had this as with chicken, so chicken chop. I have no idea. Um... Asparagus and I made a cheese sauce with cheddar cheese and butter and creme fresh and some spinach. That's what I ate today. It was fantastic. And I can eat as much as I want and lose weight. It's so awesome. I wish I knew about this diet when I was 16 or something. God damn it. The funny thing is my dad apparently when he was younger did the Atkins diet, which is very similar to the ketogenic diet. But since my dear mother uh, felt like she knew more about dieting than Dr. Atkins, wasn't that keen on me going low carb. And yeah, oh well. <sighs> I have to deal with that now. Anyway, so I am losing weight. My blood tests are getting better. I have another one next month. My doctor was really amazed. She was like, yeah, whatever you are doing, if you can, carry on with that. <laughs> and I was like, yes, I can carry on with that. I can eat, be fat and lose weight. That is not a problem. <laughs> I'm not even missing out on too many sweets, to be quite honest. If I'm hungry, I have to admit I am craving chips a little bit. But A, I can make my own chips with zucchini. It's a shame that there are no zucchini chips just out to buy, but I, maybe in a few years. Who knows? But if I'm actually if I actually ate something, I have no cravings. So I'm not sitting here like, oh, I need to, oh, you know, a big pack of chips and or oh, cookies or whatever. I I don't. I just don't care too much for this anymore. 
if I feel like I want something sweet, I usually take some heavy cream, whip it, put some baking chocolate in it beforehand, some artificial sweetener, whip this, and yeah, have some mousse, ketogenic mousse. Of course, I do have to be careful with that, but it is a sweet dessert, so it's not something I eat to be full, it's just something to, you know, kill some cravings. And honest, and the good thing, the really good thing is, I can, I can um, reward myself with food, which is something you shouldn't do when you're on a diet, because most people are like, oh yeah, I, I, I lifted my weight, now I can eat some chocolate because I lifted. No, 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 I don't do this. I went to the market yesterday. I wanted to buy a tuna steak, but they didn't have any tuna anymore, so I bought a salmon steak. And I ate this as a reward, because I lost weight and my blood vessels are getting better. So I can, I'm just eating what I am allowed to eat, but something better, <laughs> let's say it this way. I also bought some cream cheese on the market, it was really good, I loved it. Some, um, also fish, uh, hearing? Was it hearing? I don't know. Some fish you can eat raw. It was uh, in some oil marinade. But yeah, I don't know. And yeah, yeah, I'm quite happy about it. So I am losing weight. I am my 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 health is improving. I feel like recording that space anymore. I still do this meditating every day, five to ten minutes. I may doing it wrong, I have to change something, but it's not good when you are sitting on your sofa, you really have to sit on the floor in like straight back and concentrate on breathing, but it works, it helps me. I carried on reading my uh, engineering book, which was great, and yeah, I'm, I'm feeling quite good. I'm feeling quite good at the moment. Recorded some forest yesterday with Gilvan. That was also fun. And yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, about the forest, it's on her German channel. I will put the link in the description if you want to check it out. But yeah. Anyways, so I am recording a Let's Play. It most likely won't be up next week, but... I'm not saying I'm back, but if I feel again like doing a let's play, I I feel more inclined since I can't only since I'm since work uh, my channel has been a little bit let's say failing or so <laughs> wasn't really ever succeeding, but um, because I can only record it the weekend and yeah I guess still carrying on with those one hour parts just was a mistake. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, well, anyways, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and we will see each other soon. So, take care and goodbye.